we will solve this problem in two different ways. Let me know in the comments which way you prefer. Let's represent the lengths of the triangle's sides as A, B and C. A and B for the legs and C for the hypotenuse. H for the height of the triangle drawn from the right angle to the hypotenuse. The area of a triangle is equal to half of the product of its base and height. In a right triangle, the two legs can be called the base and the height because this angle is equal to 90 degrees. Therefore, the area of a right triangle can also be calculated as half the product of its legs. Let's equate these two expressions. 1 over 2 from both sides cancel each other. Therefore, h is equal to a times b over c. This is the formula you can use to calculate the height drawn from the right angle to the hypotenuse. Where a and b are the legs of a right triangle and c is the hypotenuse. Let's sub in our original values to determine the height. h is equal to 6 times 8 over 10, which is 4.8. And this is our answer. If you don't remember the area formula for a triangle, there is another way to solve this problem. Triangles ACH and ABC are similar because two pairs of corresponding angles are equal. Angles ACB and AHC are equal to 90 degrees and angle A is shared by both of the triangles. Therefore, the corresponding sides are proportional. AB over AC is equal to CB over CH. C over A is equal to B over H. Therefore, H is equal to A times B over C. As you can see, both methods produced the same final height equation.